I can't say what my favorite mineral is with all these other minerals around me. The rock dock is my dream. I'm a geologist and I was in the corporate world for a while, but this is kind of my dream to just pedal rocks. People call me the rock doc. I do not have a doctorate. That is not an, an education thing. That was my husband's nickname for me. Our shop is absolutely a great place to start if you have ever thought about rock hounding, gold prospecting, just enjoying the nature part of, or the science part of nature. We have all the resources. We're blessed with lots of minerals in Colorado, and especially in this area, because we have a lot of exposure, you know, from the mountains coming up and eroding away, so we've exposed some of those pockets of minerals. So I do have a couple of cases in my long shop that are just Colorado stones. So I have a lot of local prospectors I work with. But I also uh, work with a lot of importers, so I get rocks from all over the world. I think that Colorado is a geologist's dream. Our Colorado State gem is aquamarine. That is found on the mountain just five miles behind me, on Mount Antero. That is one of the premier locations for aquamarine. It also happens to be the third largest gem field in the world. Rocks and minerals are in every single portion of your life. You might not think about it, but they're there. I do have people come in that say, oh my gosh, we're just so against mining. And I'm like, you really gotta put your cell phone down and leave it alone then, because you can't have that without mining. That's just part of the process. My youngsters come in and I challenge them to tell me something that they have in their life that is not mined or grown. And they think they can do it and they never can. When I bought the shop, my dad, he would tell his friends, oh, my daughter bought a rock shop. And they're like, who buys rocks? You know, we don't get that. And a few of them stopped by the shop and they went, oh, I get it. So it kind of opens up people's eyes, I think, to a whole other side of the world that maybe they haven't seen.